Hello, everybody, and welcome back. Today, it is alumni draft time. So, I have put in alumni teams here. I did sit out the North Stars. Unfortunately, I had to sit out one. But, I'm going to randomize the team here, and we are going to be playing as the... Boom! Tampa Bay Lightning alumni. Okay. So, there we go. I mean, it doesn't really matter. Uh, I probably should have just chosen Quebec or something, but then people will be like, oh, why didn't you choose Hartford? So, I had to still random it, you know? Owner mode is off, fantasy draft on, uh, salary cap, I'll turn that off because it's a uh, unique kind of draft here. So I don't know how, how that would work exactly. And head coach edit lines, no, 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 and no. Uh, again, I saw a recent comment saying you should turn that off to find out who actually drafted the best team. And that would mean no traits. So yeah, I like it. Let's go to the quick settings here and turn injuries off. And is it here? No, it is not. It is the advanced settings. Okay. So we'll go to here and blockbuster trade alerts. Not that it's gonna happen anyway, but you know, just to sim up the or sim up the sim up the speed. Speed up the sim. Okay, there we go. Head coach firing. No, I'm good. Okay, so yeah, let's do this thing. Start career. We're gonna get pick 12. Here we go. Come on. Oh, I was so close. So close. We got 13. Alright, well, let's start the draft and see what happens here. So, better vote. Just went. Okay, Lidstrom, Richard. There's going to be doubles as well. Got to keep that in mind. Most likely, anyway. And, yeah, Wayne Gretzky, across the board here, <laughs> went to several teams. But, here we go. My turn to draft Marc Messier. He's 94 overall. Pretty good. Medium franchise potential. Marenz, high franchise potential. I don't know if I know this guy. But, I feel like I should. Okay, well... Mark Messier would be a good center to start off with. Yeah, good thing I didn't do the, the salary cap. Okay. Paul Coffey. Hmm. He is loaded up with X-Factor slash abilities. Timu Solani. Ooh-wee. Hmm. I kind of want to go with Timu. I'm going to do it. Timu Solani, you are the first selection to the Tampa Bay Lightning. Chris Pronger. Okay. What about goalies, too? Uh, we got Billy Smith. Okay. Ed Belfour. Eddie the Eagle. Okay. Mike Vernon. Saros. I guess he is a Nashville Predators alumni. Uh, Bernie Perron. Okay. Nice. Uh, Curtis Joseph. Cujo. Hmm. That is tempting. But you know what? I'm going to go with Eddie. Let's go. Seeing a lot of these names is just like a throwback. Like, again, that just makes me think of NHL 03 again. We still have Rob Blake, who has an X-Factor. So I'm going to take Rob to be our first defensive pick. And, man, there's a lot of good players here. Very curious to see what kind of teams people build. Or the other GMs build. And by that, I mean the AI. Uh, Stan Makita. So many abilities going on here, too. Except for you, Rod. So I think I might have to rule you out. I do love me some... Al McInnes, but we need forwards here. So, who will be our first pick for centers? It's either going to be Trache or Makita. Kind of leaning towards Trache. Yeah, I'm going to take him. All right, let's go. So, we do need a left winger, as we currently do not have one. And Johnny Busick looks like he is the pick to make. Yeah, looks solid. He only has one ability, but that's okay. That's all right. So our first line is complete. Nice. And if McInnes is still there for some reason, I'm... Okay, he's gone. Pierre Turgeon. Uh, Keon. Okay. Newendike. Lapointe. Dan Boyle. Oh, yeah. All right. Who shall we take now? So, Rod the Bod. I'm going to take Rod the Bod. Yeah. It's done. It is a done deal. Dan Boyle. We do only have one defenseman, actually, at the moment. So, yeah. I will take Daniel Boyle. There we go. Make that selection. Okay, so we have one line, our first defensive pair, and a starting goaltender so far. Ooh, Primo. Keith Primo. Six foot five. He's a big lad. I didn't know that. Okay. Uh, Dave Andrichuk. Owen Nolan. No way. This just reminds me of like NHL 2002. All right. Owen Nolan. I am. Is that Randy Carlisle? Oh my word. Okay, well, I'm grabbing Owen Nolan for now. I'm debating between Tangay and Hayduke, but we do need a left winger, so I think I'm going to take Alex Tangay. Uh, yeah, he's got two abilities. 
Solid, solid. All right. Welcome to the squad. And now, I would like to draft two defensemen in a row. And one just jumped right out at me. Barrett Jackman. 85 overall. He shoots left. Do I need... Let's see. Okay, let's go to defenseman here. And I want to check our drafted players. So, we got... A righty and... Oh, two righties. Okay, they are both right-handed. So that actually works out splendidly. So I could take Jackman. Campbell shoots left. Uh, okay, I don't really know who this guy is, unfortunately. And Jeff Brown. Also not really. Willie Mitchell. Also not really, but I said it like Willie. Okay. Anyway, I'm going to take Barrett Jackman. Yes, sir. And then we need uh, another left defenseman, Sammy Sallow. Every time I see that name, I just think of the horrific injury that occurred to that poor man with um, the groin area, shall we say. Okay, so I need a left-handed defenseman. And I would prefer if they have abilities. So there's only two there, I guess. Sammy Sallow, who shoots right. And then we have Robin Regeer, who shoots left. So welcome to the team, Robin. Good team so far. Maybe I should take a backup goalie and then we could start looking at our bottom pair. Kelly Rudy. Ooh. Sean Burke. All right. Uh, anyone else I recognize? Toscala got scored on from the other end. That was a good time. Yeah. Uh, Hedberg. Kid. Healy. Man, there's a... Tebow. No way. Guy's sick. <laughs> Look at that salary. How can I say no to that? Jocelyn Tebow. Yeah. Welcome to the team, dude. Guy's getting paid like nothing. Claude Lemieux. He's a good depth player. Ray Ferraro. Wow. Look at that. He, had, he has three abilities, actually. Ooh. That just made things trickier. I'm going to take Ferraro. Yeah, yeah. And then let's hope Lemieux's still there. Maybe we could grab him, but I doubt it. He's still there! All right, welcome to the team. Rick Tockett. Aw, oh, dude. His, like, stuff on the panel right now is so good. Ah, why you gotta make this so hard? I gotta take Talkit. I'm sorry, I do. I think I'm gonna grab Brian Prop just because he's sick. And, you know, when I sent him a thing for an autograph, he returned it. So, <laughs> with more involved as well. So, let's go ahead and place Brian Prop on the team. Yeah, beautiful. Okay, so we... Need one full line and our final defensive pairing, Hanzus. Yeah, I remember him as well. Adriana Coyne, Zidlicki. Okay, Craig McTavish. Just taking like all of the analyst type people now, apparently. Uh, who else can we take? Yeah, you know what? Maybe I should just take him. Just because, why not? Sure, let's do it. And then I'm going to take Langenbrunner. Welcome to the team. Yeah, and we now need still two defensemen. Is this who I think it is? Oh my word. Ryan Whitney. All right, fine. Get on the team. Pink Whitney. Okay, next we have Darcy Tucker. I don't even care that we already have right wingers. Darcy Tucker is a part of my team immediately. Effective immediately. Thank you, Darcy. Boom. Make that selection. All right. We need one defenseman now. Who will it be? Will it be Fetter Titan? Uh, maybe. Will it be Jacques Georges? Perhaps. Defenseman drafted. Okay. So, yeah. He's left. So, we do need a right-handed defenseman. Uh, let's try to find one here. Okay. So, we got Krupp. Yeah. And we have Rustalainen. Okay. Okay. Ooh, Bob Bond. He's got to be, I thought he'd be like an enforcer, D-man. All right, Aaron Ward. I doubt there's going to be any with abilities at this point. I saw one, but they were left-handed. I mean, we could just grab him anyway. Craig Ludwig. He shoots left, but he does have an ability. Yeah, let's risk it for the biscuit. All right, team is done. We are ready. To go. Look at this team. What if I move Busick up? Okay, that ruins that. I'm keeping that plus five up there then. Yeah, yeah. Solani, Trache, and Tange, and then Busick, Brindamore, Nolan, Tocket, Ferraro, Prop, Tucker, McTavish, Langenbrunner. I am down. Uh, I'm not down with this though. Also, Brian Allen didn't draft you. So we need to go to left defense. Ludwig, 
Boom. There you go. Oh my word. Okay, well that sucks. Big time. What can I do here? They're mostly left slash right defense. Okay, that works. I'll just move Whitney here. Sure. Yeah, yeah, because that way we have zero. And, ooh, just going to leave it. Blake and Boyle give a plus one. Uh, Whitney, Jackman, zero. And then Regeer and Ludwig also a zero. And in net, we have Belfour and Jocelyn Tebow. Okay. So this is our squad. We only have one X-Factor. Oh, no, we have Rob Blake, so that's two. Yeah, and did Belfour have any? No, he does not. Okay, that's our team. I'm going to say Solani gets the most points. I mean, yeah, of course. And let's say he gets 85, okay? And I'm going to say we do make the playoffs. We get 46 wins. It's going to be a good team. I hope, anyway. Let's find out. We're off to, like, a mediocre start here, you know? It's not... Okay, never mind. This is worse than mediocre. We need to string together some Ws here, ladies and gentlemen. There we go. That's more like it. Quebec? Ah, they got us. All right. Win against Minnesota. Loss against St. Louis, but a bounce back win against St. Louis. Great stuff. All right, let's keep it going here, guys. We're doing okay. 10-1 loss to the Dallas Stars. What on earth happened there? That's a big yikes. Okay, well, playoffs are starting to look unlikely, which to me is absolutely shocking. I got to see what these other teams are made of, man, because what is going on? I'm not even going to bother going into the... Uh, okay, fine, just to see, but CPU trading is off, and we are also not trading. Willie O'Ree, 84, okay. Merrick Sidlicki, uh, Prop, Simpson, Berard, yeah, I think his one eye got absolutely screwed, which is very unfortunate. Minnesota's trying to get rid of Pink Whitney, okay, well, there you go. Let's continue simming. We are not making the playoffs, no, we are not even really close, so I am... Very curious to see what these other teams consist of. Can we at least finish with as many wins as regulation losses? No, we cannot. <laughs> what a bad team. You guys suck. All right, stop the simulation. Let's go see what the heck is going on. So 84 points from Team Usulani. Attaboy. He did well. Yeah, and then it's like, whoa, Owen, Nolan, Brindamore, and Busick. What were you guys doing? Wow, that is absurd. Whitney with a dash 17, classic. Wow. That is shocking, to say the least. Belfort with an 898. This guy just did not get it done. Well then, let's view the team stats here. So we finished last in the Atlantic Division. Entire league. St. Louis wins the President's Trophy. Let's see if we finished last in the league. I don't think we would have finished last in the league, but... Man, we were bad. Oh my, we're second last. We had one more point than Chicago. Okay, apparently I don't know how to draft alumni. Scroll all the way to the top here again. So, the St. Louis Blues have Wendell Clark, Abel, Abel, and Recky. Uh, okay, like, yeah, that team isn't that... I don't get it, man. I don't get it. Their team's good, but come on. Oh, there Eddie Belfour did insane, eh? All right, I see you. Cool. Anyway, let's check out the league stats here. Obviously, Wayne Gretzky is probably going to be up there times three. Yeah, he is 97 overall. He put up 99, 97, and 96 points, respectively. Stevie Y put up 92. Martin St. Louis with 89. Okay, good stuff. And Solani's actually up there. Okay, so we had one guy up there. Good stuff. And if we go to goalies, Hextall, Ronnie, had a 914, a 924 for Terry Sawchuk. Immaculate. All right. <laughs> Saros is up there too. That's so weird seeing like a current player who is, yeah, he's actually 27. You know, these guys are fake 27. He's actually 27. Time to find out who wins the Stanley Cup. Continue. Buffalo swept the Capitals. Just destroyed them. Arizona swept the Jets. And the Stanley Cup goes to... Oh, guess we're not going to find out. It goes to... Oh, they pushed the Game 7. It goes to the Buffalo Sabres. Okay. There you go. Let's have a look. Where'd they finish in the standings? And team stats. 
Um, I guess I could just do that. Yeah. So they finished first in the division. Now I'm curious about the league. Second. So they just had an absolute killer team here. They had Wayne Gretzky, Robitaille, Mahovlich. Okay. McMillan, Howard Chuck, Shanahan, Shanaban, Roberts, McTavish, Knubel. I don't know, man. Their team doesn't look phenomenal. So something is, <laughs> I don't get it. The simulation engine in this game uh, never fails to impress me. Okay, so Buffalo Sabres win that. President's Trophy goes to St. Louis. And individual, we got Wayne Gretzky with the Art Ross and the Hart. Housley with the Norris. Gretzky with the Lady Ping. Um, Mason McTavish. Oh, with the Calder. Okay. Wayne Gretzky with the Con Smythe. Sawchuk with the Vesna. Vernon with the Jennings. Pronger gets the Masterton. Um, Dayarnay gets the Jack Adams. Gretzky with the Selkie, the Ted Lindsay, and the Rocket Richard. Yeah, he cleaned up. Here you go. Playoff tree. That's what it looked like. Okay. So this just in. I have no idea how to draft alumni teams, apparently. So if you guys know what I did wrong, feel free to let me know. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you soon.